the Spidosas by R. Jim Bugger. It was a better spring day in Equestrias when Tea Light Sparkle was in her study where she lived. Spike, she said, come here, Spike. And Spike came over to her. What do you want, Twilight? Spike said. And Twilight said, Spike, I need you to get me the book of magic. Okay, Spike said, I will get it for you. And he went over to the bookshelf to get the book for Twilight Sparkle. It was a dusty book, and Spike almost sneezed, but he didn't. He gave the book to Twilight, and she said, thank you. Spike, go away now. And Spike said, okay, I will go away. And he slided away like a dragon. Twilight opened the pook to chop the five and said, okay, magic, please happen. And the magic began happening in her horn. And she did the spell. It was a magic spell and she knew it was magic. Which is why she casted it, because her cutie mark is magic, because she is a unicorn. The spell made everything bigger and ate. Why is everything bigger and ate? Twilight said. Oh, it is because I am a spider now. Sad face. Spider Twilight went up to the bookshelves to find a fixed spell to fix the spell. But she couldn't open the books or even grab them because she was a spider and not a unicorn. And her horn was gone and she did not have a voice that could or speak loud enough for Spike to hear her. I didn't go get her book for her. I didn't even if she did. She probably wouldn't want to because Spike would see her as a spider and maybe get scarred or angry and then stomp all over or her, which would make her dead spider twilight. ABD, that is bad. And then she heard a voice, well not really a voice, but it sounded like another spider. She all could understand the spider clicks and she knew that it was a spider and that she had to go and talk to this other spider because that is what spiders do, talk to other spiders. A red spider appeared and said, hello Twilight, I am a big Mac spider now, why? And Twilight Spider said, uh, Big Mac Spider, is it because I casted a spell that was sent wrong? And the Big Red Mac Spider said, okay, well maybe, but can you fix it? And Twilight said, sad face. Oh, okay, said the Red Spider. Well, if we are going to be spiders forever, let's have spider sex. And Twilight Spider said, okay, but I don't know how to have spider sex. And Big Spider Mac Red said it was probably easy. Okay, are you okay with this? I am asking permission to have spider sex with you. Twilight said, I don't know. Spiders are creepy and weird. Sod face. And then Big Mac said, Twilight, we are spiders. And then Twilight said you have a point okay i guess if we have to make the most of it right and then big mac said that is the spirit yes okay spider sex they started to have spider sex and it felt really weird for twilight but twilight never even had normal regular pony sex so spider sex was the weirdest most strange thing Ever. It was like a crunchy potato chip bag full of chips could throw it into a chain link fence. And I don't know where this metaphor goes sing Amy no. After the spider sex, Twilight felt funny on the inside. Like something real, not normal. 
Big Mac Spider said, Is it okay, Twilight Spider, if I live here with you so we can have more spider sex? And Twilight said, I don't know, I guess so, but I don't want to have spider sex for a while. That was weird. Sod face. And Big Mac Spider Red said, This is okay, I will wait for you to be ready because I am a gentle spider. And Twilight said, okay, I appreciate it.